Hello, holy people, how are you doing? Life is good. You feel the holiness of the holy days. Well, we're going through some uh, challenges with, um, but we're trying to get over it in this life that you know that one drop of light is rejecting tons of darkness so a normal decent person will understand that corresponding to the crazy amounts of darkness drops of light won't be enough so uh, we're trying to break through those uh, challenges and to make it happen for the wide world to holiness, to godliness, to the beauty of our wonderful creature, unique something and meaningful. In this messed up world, there's a problem. The problem is that the evil inclination that is known as the Yetzirah is making us believe and think that bad things can happen to us in life even in a worse situation because not only that they are suffering from the imagination of having troubles in their lives and soon we'll explain what does it mean they're also suffering from an extra thing in addition to the regular the thought that the Yetzer himself is the one that is triggering them and and troubling them and making problems in their lives so not only that they're going through all the difficulties of a regular person thinking oh I'm suffering oh I'm not good oh it does faith disease that is called um, negative thoughts and fears from the Yetzara because they are thinking to themselves oh the now I sinned now I violated those rules now I didn't do this now I didn't do that whatever and because of that they're thinking to themselves now the devil the Yetzara the evil inclination the darkness my contamination my impurity is destroying me that's why i'm suffering because i'm not pure because i messed up because i failed and on and on bunch of nonsense lies and and uh, things that are far from from being the truth now what is so great about all this crazy game that um, in reality the evil inclination in a breath of a hell cannot even like get into your life from no opening and no window just there is only one aspect of the evil inclination in your life and it's in your mind in reality only the creator is deciding what you will go through in life and there is no existence else no other existence except of him and the only place that the evil inclination is catching so to speak is in your mind in your thoughts that he's making you believe that he's exist that he makes you think that you messed up and that you failed and then as a result of that real failure of you to fall in that trap and believing and following the advice of the Yetzirah like that he has an existence in your life and that you really messed up and that you are being punished and all those nonsense that are not really true and why they're not true because the challenges that you're going through are needed challenges to build you and to shape you and design you in a holy way that will bring you to the next stage to make you more humble to make you more gentle to make you more nice more kind more whatever less stubborn less 
sick and on now the great thing about it like we said before is that really in reality the evil inclination cannot touch you and the whole game here is taking place only in your mind and there is only one way to win it and it's not to fall in the trap of the negative thoughts that are making you believe that you messed up and that something is wrong just no matter what happens in your life you should always climb back to faith no matter how low you reached in your last falling you should always climb back like nothing ever happened before and just keep on searching and reaching and hoping and yearning and praying and, 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 and carving your way toward your true happiness toward the one that you believe in him that it's Hashem that it's the Creator the, the source of blessings and, 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 and good now all the enemies that we think we have are in our mind in reality all the challenges and all the obstacles that we're facing are only steps that while climbing on them and dealing with them we're reaching such high levels and deep understandings and being purified May Hashem bless you that you'll find true happiness and that only wonderful things will take place in your life and that your faith will be solid and, 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 and grounded I don't know, grounded? solid let's stick to solid and stable will be and help us to share the videos and Facebook is making um, piling difficulties on us on the private page of uh, Dror Moshe Kasuto um, even if I'm posting over there on Dror Moshe Kasuto so not um, all of our followers are receiving the notifications anymore it's like kind of a struggle so subscribe to um, Rav Dror page on Facebook and turn on the notifications on Rav Dror's page Rav Dror's page on Facebook and uh, have fun that it will be a beautiful Shabbat and that life will illuminate and shine for us all as one and that only good things will take place in our lives thank you be strong and happy we hope you enjoy this video very much please now remember to subscribe and like this video and share it with your friends to help spread faith in the world for more please visit amuna.com may your light shine always and your requests should be answered with the greatest blessings amen